Hi, Shui. Hi, Anne. Hey, you're wearing a new t-shirt. It's a Mari Meko, no? Yeah, this is where I work now. <laughs> <laughs> so no longer in the gallery? Yeah, unfortunately, I have to find a job where it pays a little better. <laughs> <laughs> but still ambitions in the art world? Yeah, I think I'll make it back at some point. I'm yeah. still looking and, uh, yeah, taking on whatever opportunity is presented to me. Yeah. And we're still doing that uh, studio visit. Yes, we are. And uh, actually, your interest became more focused, no? Lately, you, you even have a kind of favorite at the moment. Uh, well, there's two kinds of focus at the moment. Well, I think my visit to the Venice Biennale, which is my first ever big exhibition, uh, kind of solidified my interest in video art. There was a lot of video art mm -hmm. there, and yeah. I found myself being drawn to them. Something you liked? A certain I really liked Cao Fei's film, mm -hmm. and I re really liked um, one documentary-like film by a Korean artist about women in Korea and uh, the work environment women in South yeah. Korea and in Cambodia, I think, have to face. Do you remember the artist's name? I don't no. remember. Okay. What is the second focus? Uh, the second focus is um, something that's blurry. Well, I think I've always kind of been interested in blurry stuff. Like and blurred images? Blurred images, yes. Okay. So pixelated forms and shapes or things that are just kind of made almost on purpose unclear. What is the attraction of that for you? Well, I think, first of all, it kind of uh, presents a mysterious aspect to the art or whatever images that is. And also, I suppose it's a little more real because not everyone has a high quality, <laughs> uh, high definition camera or video recorder. And also maybe I thought you, the world is mysterious right. or something. Like blurred life, no? Blurred life. Because <laughs> you never know what's going on. You look at me. <laughs> <laughs> life is not so slick as most videos are a lot very slick and clean, no? That's true. And uh, recently we visited an um, artist who is very interested in war images. I think she showed us a catalog where um, there was a lot of images and collages based on the Syrian war. And many of the images were really blurry. Yeah. For example, like uh, fighter jets, fi fighter jets in the sky, and, and I somehow find those to be really more energetic and yeah. more real. They reveal a lot, although you can't see everything, right? Yeah, because yeah. I don't know, it draws your imagination and mm -hmm. emotions. Yeah, it's not so you know, transparent at first sight. It's not true. You have to look for clues. And right. Yeah. And also, you kind of have to just make your own judgments on the, the, the situation or the image yeah. that the artist is trying to present. Thank you, Shuai. Yeah. See you see you later. See you next time. Yeah, see you soon. Bye. Bye bye.